Some people believe that living for God is very simple. So they try it. Perhaps for a day, a week, maybe a month. So when things don't turn out the way that they want it, they give up. Living for God is not easy. So get that out of your head. If it was easy, more people would do it. <laughs> By far. Let me say this. Now, back when I was a child, my mom would take me to church, man, like at least two to three times a week. So on average, twice a week, that would, or that drove me nuts going to church so much. Like, it got to the point where I <laughs> hated church, man. Like, I hated church with a passion. You know, yes, you know, I would repent and, you know, and, probably stay saved for <laughs> a couple of days or so because you know as kids you know they would really like push us to serve God and stuff like that so you know and tell us about hell and make us afraid and stuff like that so you know because no one sane wants to go to hell you know <laughs> so they would get us kids uh, and uh, teenagers too in fear and made us, not made us, but got us to repent and stuff like that and showed us and stuff like that. And when I was 18, I don't know if I wanted to serve God, but around 18 to 20 something, you know, I would try to live for God, but there were things that I wanted to do. You know, I wanted to go partying, you know, I wanted to, you know, chase women and, you know, do the things that people do now, you know? So it was really difficult for me to serve God. And to make a long story short, it took me over 10 years to get to the way that I am now, where I can consistently do what is right, other than, you know, <laughs> serve God for three days, then drop all the way down into sin, and then repent the next day, then stay saved for about two hours, then go back into sin again. No, it took me over 10 years because I would come to God, then go all the way back, <laughs> and come to God all the way back. Then I said, hey, let me just be in sin, you know? Then I stay in sin for perhaps six months or a year or whatever, or <laughs> it was crazy. So over 10 years, but you are trying it for a week and say, hey, <laughs> this is not for me. <laughs> It is not easy. Like I said before, if it was easy, more people would do it. So stop giving up so easily. And what I learned, and please use this information, the reason why it took me so long, perhaps it should only take you a month, but the reason why it took me so long because I did not want to give up the things that I wanted to do on earth, meaning like the bad things. Like before, you know, I really did not like getting drunk, you know, I, no, I wasn't really like a drinking type of person. You know, I would drink, but, you know, because I was around certain people, but like a drunkard, I really did not like being drunk too much. But, you know, doing other things and stuff like that, you know, I kind of enjoyed it. So I did not want to give up on it. But when I got to the point where I was like, hey, 
Skip all of that other stuff. Let me just do what is right. Then things became much more easier for me. See, your problem perhaps is you don't really want to give up the things that you are doing that are wrong. That's the issue. So if you correct that, living for God will be much more easier. Does that make any sense? And you may say, well, Calvin, you know, I want to live for God, but I don't know much about God. <laughs> that does not matter. Do it. The more you live for him, the more that you are going to learn. The more you pray, the more you read your Bible, the more that you are going to learn. The more you are going to learn. So don't say that, well, I don't know what to do, because you are going to learn step by step. Myself, I don't know everything. <laughs> not even close. I know some things, but not everything. And the more I learn, and if I have to change, I have to change. Because the closer you get to God, the more you find out that you have to change. Because we have to be more and more like Jesus Christ every day. So when you get closer to him, the more you see yourself like, hey, I am not doing this thing right here, so let me change this. I pray that makes sense. You know, I can talk about the Holy Spirit and stuff like that, but that may confuse you, but just the more you live for God, the more you are going to learn of him. Like you are not going to learn everything in one day. So I pray that this makes sense. God bless.